Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're unable to run the check this utility in your Windows operating environment. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. So some people might get an error saying that the volume cannot be scanned when in use. And even though I've addressed this in my tutorials in the past, some people might be coming from other locations and are trying to figure out what's going wrong or why the check disk utility is not running properly. So this tutorial should hopefully be able to address that for you guys. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu and you want to type in CMD. One of the best managers should come back as CMD here. You want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control window you want to select yes. Now into this elevated command line window you want to type in CHK DSK space and then whatever drive letter Windows is installed on. In my case it's my C drive and this probably shouldn't be your issue here but again whatever drive letter Windows is installed on then you want to do another space forward slash F and then once you have it as it appears on my screen obviously the C might be different right here depending on where Windows is installed on. You want to enter on your keyboard so it will say that the file system type is more than likely going to be an NTFS, cannot lock current drive. Check this cannot run because the volume is in use by another process. Would you like to schedule this volume to be checked the next time your system restarts? Some people might just type in check this here and then close out the command prompt or not even really realize you're supposed to keep going here in order to initiate the scan. So at this point you have to type the Y key on your keyboard and then you want to hit enter. At this point it will run the scan the next time your computer restarts. So I would recommend closing out of any open programs or applications you have at this time. Restart your computer. And you can see it's going to begin running so long as you don't press any key in the process to stop the scan. And that's pretty much it guys, it's pretty automated from here. So I do hope this brief video was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.